Oh wow, okay. We're in a ones game already, I I'm not gonna lie. I started the queue for a one search. Uh, ones game, sorry, and um, I was not expecting to find a game this quick, so I kind of haven't warmed up. <laughs> but ones, you don't really need too much warmth, for in my opinion, so let's just get straight into it. Playing Dark. Not too familiar with this player. I think I might have played him once, maybe. But we get the first goal. I'm sure he's a good player, he's high rated. 15 93, but we're starting off at 16 35, as you guys know. We're trying to get that rank one spot. I think it's at like 17.50 maybe right now. Have a look after this game. Fix another kickoff. I'm gonna fake that. He'll go in the air. This guy seems to like the air a lot. That is half and half. Nice, got a really good block on that. Lots of distance on that one. This guy's quite fast. Plays quite a mechanical play style looks. It's difficult to play new players sometimes because obviously you don't know how they play. Especially if they've been watching you. They, they kind of understand your style, although it's a bit different watching it to playing it. Oh, I thought he was going to shoot. Gonna get up to that ball early, take a block. That's fine. I know he didn't get that mid boost because he got to the ball way too quickly. Tried to sneak a shot in early because I knew he wouldn't really cover that too much. It's an interesting touch. Oh, I wanted to pop high. Try and take this ball back. He's gonna read it, but that should be fine. He can't hit. A, he can't get around the ball there to shoot that. So I know I didn't need to cover my net until he drives. If that makes sense. This guy's actually quite a difficult player to play against. Oh, that's good. That's a good fade away from him. Ah, I think we get back here. Yeah, well done. He did a really good play on that 50 there. He didn't actually go for the 50, he kind of just let me challenge the ball. That should be a free challenge, yeah. He left a little bit, a little bit too much space between himself and the ball there. That good, move in. Get back. Nice, make sure we block our net there. Okay. This guy's very aggressive. I'm just gonna flick that, that is not on target. I'm gonna fake a shot in case he dunks me there. Don't wanna risk it. Nice. I mean, he couldn't challenge me because as soon as he cha as soon as I hear him challenge me, I just double jump. He knows that, and we score either way. But then we get to a stage where I knew that if I double jump, it's gonna be a goal because we'll have too much momentum going into that. Um, that's not him, right? Yeah, we have too much momentum going into that. 50 there on this goal line, pretty much. I'm gonna start a small bounce through. I don't wanna put too much height on the ball because else we can get uh, we can get like challenged really easily. We just go for the low 50 there. The reason that works is because he has to cover the high shot and also the low 50. He can't do both. So if we just go really low on that one, it'll go underneath them every time. Get our back boost. This should be open. He kind of. He kind of got caught between the two there. He wanted to like snag the boost with the corner of his car and then go up the ball really quickly uh, because he knew we'd probably beat him if he just takes the usual boost grab with his like full car length. But then he couldn't quite get it. That's flex two over, too too high over. I mean, not just two over. Great English. I'm gonna fake a jump. When I say fake a jump, there, uh, what I mean is I don't like go for the ball straight away. I kind of like go into me, get the first win though. It's going to go 5-0. He wants a rematch. We'll give it to him. See if we can get him in the next game. Uh, there we go. Second game. Got the same guy. See if we can do the same thing. Pickoffs are going to be important. As always in one. This guy is strange, man. He's a really weird player. He fakes a lot of kickoffs. Going to go low. Yeah. Yeah, I know you'd go for a bump. Jesus Christ, guys, uh, very aggressive. Oh no, I thought. Oh, okay, there we go. I thought he was gonna go up for it, so I just had to jump with him, but he didn't. And I kind of screwed myself. I should be fine. Go high on that one. I need boost. 
we've done well with that fifth team, we've done really well. What? What? I want a replay on that, Caleb. Mr. Editor. How is that not a flip? I want a, like, full-on analysis. I want you to go into, I want the magnifying glass to come out. Okay, okay. Um, I don't, I don't want a magnifying glass, but I, I have regular glasses. So uh, let's, uh, let's take a look at this one. He's gone, he's taking the ball up. He's shooting it up, gets a nice little touch on there. He goes for the flip reset. All right, and here's where we're gonna dive in. Let's go really, we're really gonna look at this because I'm pretty sure I know why this didn't go in. All right, let's really break it down. He gets the flip, he gets the touch, and then right there, right there. Did you did you see it? I'm gonna play it one more time for you. He goes down, right there. It's because you're bad at the game. <laughs> Got him! <he. laughs> I'm 99% sure that should have been a flip, no? Maybe I'm blind. Maybe I'm just lying. That was a flip in my books. I can't shoot that, so I'm just going to go for his boost. Oh no. I think we're back. Okay, we're back. Almost over committed. That's fine. This is, he's a very good player in ones, I'm not going to lie. I'm surprised I've, I've not seen, I say in ones because I've not seen him in twos at all and de definitely not threes because I don't play rank threes and he's obviously not RCS or anything. Ah, I knew that was the wrong decision. I don't know why I did that. That was silly of him. I don't know why you'd ever pre-jump that. You had a free goal. Should be one nil up. And he's, yeah. Kind of reminds me of myself actually, like, my place start kind of when I was going up ones I'd make like silly errors like this boost grab and the you know the pre-jump. But you know you can see the talent there, he's a good player. He has the he has the like goals, but he didn't really can't take it. He has everything now, so he's a good player. He's a Middle Eastern actually maybe. But 80 ping is it's not too bad for Middle East, perhaps. I'm not too sure. Doesn't really matter though, still. Good, whatever, wherever he comes from. Actually, yeah, he might be from Middle East. Have I heard of. Is there a duck from Middle East in an RCS team, maybe? I don't really follow MENA -E RCS, to be honest. So I'm not too sure. Gets a goal back. Tried to bait him into going for it, but he didn't, he didn't fall for it. Make sure I go high on that. He's going to land before me. Luckily, he didn't land in front of like on the ball or anything underneath it. Make sure I just flick that into my corner so I can carry on with it. Almost. Can get the flick I wanted. I'm just going to hit this over to get his boost. Make sure we get that pad as well in case he wants it. Oh, that's a good 50 from him. Might be a goal. He's missed, luckily. It's difficult for him to get that open there, actually, because he was landing right beside the ball. See what he does. Oh, he lands on the save. Oh, I couldn't get a bump. Go on, pinch that. Damn it. I wanted to bait him into pinching, thinking that I overcommitted. I like his foot presets. I don't like the kind of... Well, no, I, what, I was, what I was going to say, I, I didn't want to say it because it was... I feel like it's a bit disrespectful. I was, I was like, um, I like when he goes for foot presets because... It's kind of easy to defend them, to be honest. Right now, he's not doing too good. That's not toxic. I'm There's some, sometimes I get weird comments saying like, I blame people, but like, that is not toxic. I, I just, I can't, like, I, I point out my own mistakes whenever I do these YouTube videos. I point out my own mistakes. I point out my teammates' mistakes. I point out my opponents' mistakes. Because if we want to learn, we've got to be realistic. You can't just, you know, always be nice to everyone. If, as, if they made a mistake, they made a mistake. It's not saying they're bad. If they had a bad game, it's not saying they're bad. It's like a lot of the time in recent 2 YouTube videos, I've not been having the best games from my teammates. And I've, I'm, I've been pointing it out and people keep saying like, oh, you, you're just flaming your teammates. It's like, no, they just played bad and that's fine. I'm also happy to admit that I played bad in some of these games or a lot of these games, whatever. 
But yeah, back to the video. Kind of got sidetracked. What I was going to say is, his flip sets are a little bit too easy to defend right now. You can tell that he has it. He could, he can do it. He's just not right now. That was a very bad flip forward from him. So, yeah, he's left. I mean, actually, to be fair, it's only 43 seconds. He flips forward when we're about to make a plan on the ball. You never want to flip forward when your opponent is about to hit the ball forward. Um, if that makes sense, like you never want to flip in the opposite direction that I hit the ball, I guess, if that makes sense. Um, you guys probably know what I mean from that goal. All right, third game, another rematch. I kind of, you know, it's kind of saw it coming. Bonds, oh, Jesus Christ, this guy's faked another kickoff. <laughs> He's focused more on the game, or more on the kickoffs. He's faking everyone. Um, what I was going to say, one's this like a, a game mode where high level players will always just find each other instantly. If um, no one has a game, which in one, there's not a lot of people queue at the same time. And even if there are, because because you just have to find one other person, you'll always just find the, close, the person that's closer to MR to you. So we'll always find this guy right now. If we kept queuing and he keeps queuing. Obviously, unless someone in between those queues. But I kind of presume we'll get him every game. Maybe in our last game we'll get him as well, if he keeps on queuing. Gonna have to focus on this one first, though. Luckily, I jumped there, so he probably gets a piece of the ball as well. Make sure I jump onto the wall. Yeah, we recover quicker. Didn't think he actually had boost to get to that. I wanted to fake him out and then take my time, but... Make sure he's flipped back on. That board, that's not on target, we don't have to worry about it. Damn it. That was really annoying, I didn't get a touch on the board to score. That was obvious. I'm not going to touch this ball. He can touch it if he wants to, that's fine. We can just grab this boost, we don't need to touch the ball right now. Now we do, because he could shoot. I'm going to fake a jump so he backs off. I'm just going to shoot, because he might be off his line. Almost, good positioning though. Oh, wow, okay, we have to get high. Because I thought he was about to challenge us off the ceiling. He didn't. Kind of faked us out. Yeah, great, great play. Really good dribble. Perhaps I jumped slightly too early. I think that was a defensive mistake there. Could have waited a little bit longer. I want to try and bait him into shooting that. There we go. Oh my god, okay, that's not worked at all. What, bro? This guy could be so much higher rated if he just... I, I know I'm not one to talk, but... He, he could be winning these games. <laughs> but that... that um, I want to talk about that play before I forget about it. With the, where I tried to bait him into shooting, it, it, it worked, but then... I think I was... Oh, don't get damaged. Yeah, I think I was slightly... Jax, I need to, to focus on the games. But I can talk in the replay. I think I was slightly um, a bit too delayed with going back to net with that last kickoff. Oh, not the last kickoff, the one before that. Um, else the fake would have worked. We would have got the ball in the corner and then got the boost and a free ball. But we hit the ball against our post because we were slightly too late to it. I do not get these kickoffs. I mean, they work. Fair play. That's obvious. I just have to double jump. Because he's jumping in a straight line to me. He's going to hit this back, so I'm just going to track it. What? Bro. This man has just been flicked into my boost pad. I've just been hard scammed. Flicked. I flicked him. And I flicked the ball. I can flick everything. I flick the wall. Look. There you go. That was a rhyme. That was a bar. Nice, perfect kicker. Great first touch. Ah, oh, beautiful mechanics, Jack. Those are amazing shot right there, straight on his car. He can jump all he wants. It's fine. I mean, he was going for a demo. As long as I just have half of the awareness I need to there, so easy demo to avoid because he's not he's not going at me. He's going behind me there. You always need to make sure that you're defending demos though in, in your um, in your half. Because if you get demo in your half, you probably just concede. There I knew this I could shoot this because he won't expect me to. The shot wasn't what I wanted actually, but it worked either way. Didn't catch the shot with enough power, but it works. Oh wow. I did not think he was 
This is my issue. One mistake that I make a lot of time with 1v1 especially is, you, I don't do this in twos and threes because you don't have the space to, but in ones I, I kind of think my opponent is thinking what I'm thinking. <laughs> so what I did there was I tried to jump so he gets put off from going for the ball because he thinks I'll beat him and then fake the jump so I can go down the ball and take a free ball. But obviously what the opponent sees is that they just beat me. <laughs> so they just beat me to the pool and I can see. I do that a lot, which I need to stop. Right, that was an easy demo. He took so much time there. He needs to speed that ball up. That's fine. Should be able to score off this. That 50 was really neutral, and you don't want to be taking a neutral 50 when your opponent has more boost than you. Because they can recover sooner. Especially when you're the one that's not dictating the 50, because I'm the one that has the ball. Technically, I could flick the ball still, I could do anything. But, so I'm the one dictating the 50. Or I have the most opportunities to dictate that 50. I don't know why I did that. I kind of wanted to do something funky, you know. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Get back. Is that off? No, it's on. I missed the double tap. I don't think I could have scored that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Try it not again. Oh. Thought he was going to go then. Would have been a goal if he did. Really good challenge. Double jump into this ball. Make sure I recover with a half foot. I'll just take a simple flick. It's going to be difficult for him to save that, yeah. Because he pushed so far forward. What's he saying sorry for? Yeah, he pushed very far forward there. If I just flick it on target, I come out with at least the ball and the boost. Maybe not a goal, but that's, uh, we don't need a goal. We're just trying to make a better chance to score next time. We don't want to just go for the goal straight away. But I knew that it would be a high chance to score and a almost 100% chance to get the corner boost and the ball after a save. Alright, we can just chill here. As long as we play it smart. Ah, which I haven't done. Oh yeah, yeah. Apparently it's easier said than done playing it smart. You need the brains to do that and I just didn't have it there. No. Okay. What? Bruh. How did we not demo him? I thought that's at least a trade. That was a really good challenge. That should be a goal. There we go. That was that should have been a demo here, I'm sure. Happens. Silent cases. I can't even pronounce their name. Can't speak in these videos. Alright. That should be game. Yeah, there we go. Let's go on to the last one. And for the biggest surprise of 2022, who saw that coming? We have Dark in the last match as well. Oh, and he's done another fake kickoff. Jeez, we've got two, two of the biggest surprises in 2022. Damn. That's fine. I don't want to hit that ball too hard there. I could tell he was going to challenge that because he's a very aggressive player, although I've overcommitted. And look, that's my fault. Of course, it's not my teammate's fault. There's no one else on the pitch. Oh my Jesus Christ. Alright, 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 all right, all right. Next kickoff, we're, fo we're focusing on what he does because I, I can't bother. I don't focus on kickoffs in rank. Like, what my opponent does on them is so bad. I need to play it like I play in tournaments. So obviously, you focus on it then, you see you see what they're doing. That's fine. That was not a good touch, but that works. Make sure I flick that ball, get a bit of distance. I just didn't see that demo coming because I'm tired. But I'm just bad, one of the two. I'd go more towards bad because look at that challenge. All right, all right, all right. It's, it's kickoff time. We're, we're focusing on what he does. We're paying attention. Okay. Just flip the camera stick over. Have a look at him. Doesn't challenge that one like I thought he would. Ooh. That was a mistake. I think he still has it though. <sighs> Jesus, I did not see him coming. Okay. Oh, shoots. Should be fine, right? Yeah, we're good. He panicked a little bit there. He didn't need to take... He didn't need to play this at fast. Same as that one. Luckily, I missed my flick. And the shot. I think I have time to get this boost, right? Nope. Fortunately, 
kind of rushes it as well. I think that's him. Yeah, he's, he rushed it a lot in the last 30 seconds when he had a lot of time with balls that he didn't need to rush on with that shot there. He thought he could shoot, but I don't know. It's pretty clear that I was getting back to that shot at least. In my eyes, I think he needs to fake me out there at least. Go for one. Again, it's a bit, bit rushy. The, the challenge is very obvious because he does it quite a lot to be honest. I don't want to just rip into the guy, but I'm trying to make, like I said, the other game, I'm trying to make the videos, you know, pointing out mistakes from everyone and myself. Oh, that was a great turn from him. I did not expect that. It's a difficult shot to pull off though. Oh, I went, I got the touch too high. He's good at his um, first touches that he pops in the air. They're actually surprisingly difficult to get. I'm actually not the best at those. Great save. Play that one behind him. We take a touch there, we, we, have, we just wait. We need to wait to see where he goes. If he points his car to the right, we go left. If he points his car to the left like he did, we go right behind him. Miss the boost pad. I want him to jump. Again, he kind of rushes the shot. Oh, and that one. I'm just going to bump him out of the way. Hopefully he goes, yeah. I'm going to have to fake that to go for the boost. Ooh, a nice catch. Make sure I flip there really early. Position for the 50 in case he goes for it. And we should be able to just take the open that. Nice. We just fade away from that 50 because we know he's going to flip into the ball. He thinks we're right behind the ball, so we use the ball to hide ourselves from him. And then he thinks we're right behind it, but we're actually kind of spaced out a little bit. So when he flips into the ball, we just kind of, you know, let him hit it against us. Good kick up from him. Bad one from me. Bit of a bad kick off. Try and bump him as he miss the bump. That's going to be another goal. It's a great shot. Slots it behind me. Bit of a few poor kickoffs. And another one, really. Okay, this guy, he needs to chill out. <laughs> He's a great player, he needs to relax though. He has more time than he thinks, but perhaps, you know, it could be. Oh, I missed the power shot. Perhaps it could be a ping, you know, eight ping though. I'd... I think that's fine to play with. I have done the worst play on defense. Possibly. That was terrible. I had the save to the right and I went into him. I see the fake, finally. It's a perfect flick. You, know, you can't save that. Realistic. He's got 12 boosts. There is no way he saves that. Once the flick gets off. If he wants a chance, he needs to challenge me, but he can't challenge me. I have too many angles. That's a great kickoff. That's going to be another goal. Damn it. Three kickoff goals. Need to step it up. Need to make sure we're playing the kickoffs good. Why is he faking so many kickoffs if he's winning them all? <laughs> I need to create angle for myself, but I can't because he can just challenge me whenever I try to. Trip him up here, and again. Don't take that ball to the side, we need to pressure him. Oh, that's good. Oh, I had the goal, back flipped. Oh, he goes, he doesn't see me. Bruh, does he not see me or something? Maybe this is what I'm talking about earlier, where I think my opponent, he, yeah, that's, my, that's just a bad play from me, because in my eyes, I thought he sees me, so he, he can't go for the ball. But in his eyes, he, he just doesn't see me. So of course he's not. He, of course he's just going to go for it. Oh my god! He almost had the best recovery of his life. But yeah, that that, that last goal was my fault completely. It wasn't like a ball chase. A lot of people call that a ball chase. Oh, not another. Okay. Kiraz has not not been kind to me this game. I say that is you know it's complete skill based. So I haven't been kind to myself. Nice, there we go. Got the little comeback. We just need to 
keep up and score another to win this game. Oh god. Oh, that's actually worked. The one kickoff we messed up has worked. No, I missed. Right. Should still get a goal here. It's a really good shot, to be honest, but it was easy to pull off from that angle. This hit here is what gives us a goal because he plays for the corner boost and the hit goes mid. And we land, we land before him and we can go mid. Shoot. It's all about recoveries. Recoveries are really important. Probably the most important mechanic, actually. Nice. I'm gonna fake it. Ah, oh, I was gonna keep it up, friend, but he forfeits, we get the win. Let's see where we actually are on the leaderboard. Have a look. Not too high, probably. 13th. Pushing into the top 10. I'm gonna play more ones, guys. It, it, it's really difficult for me to get ones videos out for you guys because it's difficult to find the games, um, especially at the times I record because of school and scrims. Um, I, I have to record late sometimes, but I'm trying my best to push out the ones content whenever I can. I'm going to try and make more and just put more time into getting the games. It, it sometimes can take me over an hour to find them, but you know, if you guys want it, I can try and do it. But if you enjoyed this video, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel, guys. You guys have been absolutely killing it late with the likes and subscriptions, so make sure you keep that up. Make me happy, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for another daily video. Take care, everyone.